Welcome to this educational video on cell structure and organelles. In this journey, we will explore the fascinating world of cells and their tiny but essential components known as organelles. Let's dive in. Cells are the fundamental units of life. They come in various shapes and sizes, from simple single-celled organisms like bacteria to complex multicellular organisms like plants and animals. All living things are composed of cells, and each cell is a microscopic wonderland of organelles that carry out specific functions to keep the cell alive and functioning. The cell membrane is like the cell's gatekeeper. It surrounds the cell and controls the movement of substances in and out, maintaining a stable internal environment. Inside the cell membrane, we have the cytoplasm, a jelly-like substance that supports the organelles and facilitates their interactions. At the center of most eukaryotic cells, we find the nucleus. This organelle houses the genetic material, DNA, which carries the instructions for the cell's activities and heredity. The DNA exists in the form of chromosomes and controls how the cell grows, divides, and functions. The endoplasmic reticulum is a network of membranes involved in protein synthesis and transportation within the cell. It can be rough, studded with ribosomes, or smooth, without ribosomes. After proteins are synthesized in the ER, they move to the Golgi apparatus, which modifies, packages, and distributes them to various parts of the cell or for export outside the cell. Meet the mighty mitochondria. These are often called the powerhouses of the cell because they produce ATP, the energy currency of the cell. Mitochondria are double membrane organelles and have their own DNA, suggesting an evolutionary link with ancient bacteria. In plant cells, we have chloroplasts, which are green-colored organelles. These are the sites of photosynthesis, a remarkable process where sunlight, carbon dioxide, and water are converted into glucose and oxygen, providing energy for the plant. Vacuoles are large, membrane-bound sacs that store various substances like water, nutrients, and waste products. They play a role in maintaining cell turgidity in plants and storing materials in animal cells. Lysosomes, on the other hand, are like the cell's recycling centers, containing enzymes that break down waste materials and cellular debris. The cytoskeleton supports the cell's structure and provides a scaffold for its organelles. This intricate network of protein filaments consists of microtubules, microfilaments, and intermediate filaments. The cytoskeleton is responsible for cell shape, movement, and even cell division. Cells have a life cycle, which includes growth, replication, and division. The cell cycle consists of interphase and mitosis, ensuring that new cells are created and old cells are replaced. And there you have it. A glimpse into the fascinating world of cell structure and organelles. These tiny components work together harmoniously, driving the complex processes of life. Understanding cells and their organelles is essential to comprehending the intricacies of life itself. Thank you for joining us on this journey of discovery. Stay curious and keep exploring. If you found this video informative, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more educational content. Until next time, goodbye.